Hi guys, welcome to Empower In and welcome to Motivation Monday. So in this Motivation Monday, I wanted to talk about an email that I received a little, a little while ago, but uh, I just remembered it now, so I wanted to talk about it. It is an email from someone that asked, how do you stay focused when you're extremely exhausted? And I really like that question because I have a lot of good techniques that I do in order to stay focused when I am extremely exhausted. So unfortunately, sometimes, you know, we might not sleep right. Maybe we're parents and we have young ones that don't know the difference between night and day and <laughs> they don't understand that we have to work. So sometimes we end up going to work extremely tired. I know, especially when I was flipping from nights to days, I would start my 12 hour shift sometimes on zero sleep, absolute zero, zero sleep and I would get very, very nervous that I would make a mistake, which is a very legitimate fear. <laughs> so here are some things that I did and still do when I do find myself at work being um, just completely tired and depleted. So the first thing that I do is I drink a lot of water. A lot of people do not understand just how energizing water is, but one of the first signs of dehydration is feeling tired. So sometimes when I feel tired, what I do is I quickly drink about two cups of water and then I start walking. So actually that leads into the second thing that I do, which is moving. Moving is the most energetic thing you can do. Objects that are in motion will stay in motion. And that is very true because when we are tired, what we really wanna do is just sit back and or lay down and relax but it is the worst thing to do when you're at work because you need to work so yes just stay moving and stay hydrated and that will help you out even right there that might be all you need so the next thing that i would recommend is to make sure you have people double check you you are never alone at work and sometimes you just need to tell people your coworkers listen, I'm really tired, does this look right to you? Can you just double check this for me? I do that all the time, guys. There's no harm in asking for help. We can't do this job by ourselves. We're all gonna need to help each other out. So even if you're asking silly questions, it's okay. You know, hey, can you take a, a double look at this? I'm just so tired, you know, my, my kid kept me up all night. There's nothing wrong with that. What I always think about is, do I want to ask somebody for help or would I prefer making a mistake that could cause harm to somebody, which, you, nobody wants to go there. So there's no harm, you're never alone. Definitely ask for help. The third thing that I do, which I guess is sort of common sense, there's nothing wrong with drinking a cup of coffee. Sometimes coffee has the opposite effect. For some reason, I can only drink one cup. After that, it's more tiresome to my body. Maybe it just dehydrates me too much, I'm not sure. But also B vitamins. Um, B6, B12 are awesome for energy. So those are great to have in your lunch bag on those days when you're just so tired. Also another vitamin that I take for other reasons, but I also take it for energy is FOT. FOT really does help me feel a lot better and help me focus a lot more. So that's just some things to consider. Look up some vitamins that are good for your body and also good for energy. It's good to have those just in case you need them because you know, when you least expect it, you might need it. And it's always just good to have. <laughs> Another thing that I like, and I have the bottle right here, is um, turmeric pills. Turmeric pills help with inflammation. Inflammation is something that can take a lot of energy out of your body. So if I do see that I'm really tired, um, I will take a turmeric pill. Um, it's not one of those things that gives me energy immediately. I usually take it in conjunction with something else but I do think that it helps quite a bit. And there's so much good information on turmeric that it can't hurt anything for sure. The last thing that I wanna mention is during the shift when you feel like every hour and minute and second is just slowly creeping by, just remind yourselves that 12 hours always ends. So no matter how long it feels, you will be driving home and you will be crawling into your bed very soon. There is light at the end of the tunnel. So whether that means that you need to call your husband and be like, listen, I'm so tired today. Can you please do this and this so that it's a little bit easier for me to get home? You might need to make special arrangements for that, but it's worth it. You, we all have to work together for the betterment of the family, for the team. You know, sometimes I'll tell my husband, because we usually work out after I get home from work, you know, I'm just tired today. I'm just gonna go straight to bed and I do. So just get those solid hours of sleep in and don't worry, when that shift is creeping by, 
it, it will come to an end. So I hope you guys liked all of those tips. I wanted to ask you a question. I've been thinking about uploading some like personal videos to share more like personal, um, I don't know, the more personal side of me. Um, like just for example, in the middle of March, I'm actually going to India and I was thinking about maybe blogging, um, video blogging about my trip. So if that's something you'd be interested in seeing, um, I think it would be a lot of fun. I think, you know, I would enjoy it. Uh, my husband's from India, so that's one of the reasons why we're going, but he also has a conference there. So um, anyways, if that's something that you'd like to see, then give this video a thumbs up and if you could post a comment. I would like to get a little bit more personal on here, um, if possible, if that's what you guys want. If it's not what you guys want to see, I totally understand, so don't worry about it. But um, I don't know, I think it'd be fun. So anyway, just let me know what you think and I will talk to you soon. I love you guys so much. Bye.